The nullifier is a very simple machine from the thermal expansion mod pack, and its main purpose is to destroy blocks. To craft one you'll need one invar ingot, two tin ingots, a bucket of lava, and a pneumatic servo. Here we can see the nullifier's front face has a square lava window on it. This corresponds to the middle face in the configuration window. By default, the front face will always face towards you when you place it down. Right clicking on it will bring up its interface. We can see that it only has one inventory slot, and as soon as items come into it, they'll be permanently destroyed. The nullifier doesn't require any redstone flux to operate. You can manually place items in the inventory to be destroyed, or you can bring them in via item ducts. To do that, open the configuration window and set one of the faces to blue. As you can see, the front face corresponds to the middle face on this window. From there, the rest of the faces are positioned relative to that face. I'll change the colors to blue as I go, just so you can see. This one here is the top face. This one here is the left, this one here is the right, this is the bottom one, and of course this is the face on the back. Once a face is set to blue, you can bring the items in via an item duct. So here, I'm just going to use a leadstone item duct and draw the items out of this chest. Always remember to set the leadstone pipe connecting to the chest to output by right clicking on it with a crescent hammer, and of course power it with a redstone signal. I'll put some dirt blocks here in this chest so you can see. The dirt blocks are being carried out and into the nullifier, where they're being destroyed instantly. This part is optional, but there's also a redstone control panel here on the interface where you can set the nullifier to respond to certain redstone inputs. It'll work as normal even if you don't change any of the settings in here. If you found this video helpful or informative, please give it a like, and if you want to see more tutorials like this one, you might want to consider subscribing. If you have any questions, please post them in the comments, and have a great day!